Hello everyone. If you are watching this and it's a replay, then just click replay and give me the time that you are on at in your time zone. So if it's a replay, just just type in replay and um, tell me the time where you are now. Hello everyone. I hope everybody's doing well. I'm just taking my shoes off. I just got back from my last client for the day. It's nine o'clock at night in Dubai. And um, if, you, if you're on, give me a shout out. Hello. And hello everybody from my side. It's Micheline from the Snake Diet and the Kapow Life from Dubai. And I'm looking forward to chatting with everybody tonight. Just a quick update on everybody's weight loss, fat loss. So if you're watching the replay, give me a replay and your time zone where you are at. So good morning to everybody and good evening to everybody that are on, that's on my side as well. It's nine o'clock my side and how's everybody doing? Is everybody well? I'm sure everybody's nice and strong and staying positive and not getting emotional. So let me give a few shout outs before I get stuck into my live chat with everybody on my VIP Snakers group and those that are popping in from my Snake Diet coaching group on Facebook. Hi, Liesl. Hello, Liesl. Mike, give me a shout out, hello. Paula, hello. Marina, hello. Shana, hello. Amy, hello. Hi there. Rosara, Rosara. Ha, hola, hola. <laughs> hola. How are you feeling? Hey, Scarlett. Okay, hi Larry from New York City. Wonderful, Larry. Great. Guys, tell me from where you're saying hi from. Larry's from New York, New York City. Yana. Hello, Yana again from Abu Dhabi. Am I correct? I remembered. Uh, Ro Rosara is from Massachusetts. Liesl's from Dubai. Okay, you guys, I'm sure you're feeling fantastic. It is now Sunday night in Dubai. It must be Sunday morning for the majority of you guys. If not, it doesn't matter. We're all on together. Give me a thumbs up and a heart. All right, guys, we are doing so fantastic. You guys are doing amazing. I am like so proud of you. I just I couldn't wait to speak to everybody this evening. Um, I'll give you a quick update on what's happening. The, everybody had to say says network low, connection low. If it pops off, I'm going to pop back on again, okay? Um, everybody had to give me their accountability update pictures as well as their scale weights after their, after their, I think it was their, their, was the, they were going they were doing a 96 hour and within that 72 hour they had to give me their accountability pictures and the updates of the scale weights and then those pictures had to be sent to coal snake diet motivation page for a further update on all those that are supporting them in the snake diet motivation community page so not only are we supporting them here on youtube and our lives and our snake diet coaching group on Facebook, but also the community that's supporting all our snakers in the Snake Diet Motivation page. So we had to do an update for, for all the supporters and they are doing so fantastic and well done to all the new, the newbies that have joined my VIP group 
I keep the group nice and small so I can get more personalized with everybody and get to know them a little bit closer, build a, a closer relationship with them and become like um, buddies, you know, like supporting buddies. And um, well done to the newbies that have joined and they are doing fantastic. They are, everybody, let me explain something. Everybody is losing from a pound and more a day. How fantastic is that? Shana has lost just over 19 pounds already within less than a month. I think she's been doing the fasting routines now for just over three weeks, just going into four weeks on all just over 19 pounds. Done and dusted, gone. I'm so proud. And let me just give you a quick, I'm just gonna brush through, not the whole. Grace has lost 10 kilograms. That's like 22 pounds, am I right? Grace has lost, and that's in this, that's with like in three, three weeks. If I'm wrong, Grace tell me, but this is, these are the stats that I'm looking at, okay? And from the, the, the accountability post, you guys, I've just been up, I just checked up on the accountability posts in the Snake Out Motivation page that you sent from when you first started and your updated pics now and your scale weights now. And confirmed within the VIP Snakers Messenger group. So you guys are really, really, really hitting it hard. I'm so proud. Amy has just started, she's, an, uh, uh, she's not a new snaker, <laughs> but she's new in my VIP group and she's down 11.4 pounds and she's just started now 10 days ago that is fantastic you see everybody's losing a pound and more a day i'm so proud of everybody in my group and all those that are following on youtube are following us with our uh, fasting routines you guys are also doing fantastic because i'm getting a lot of private messages Giving me an update on your progress. Um, just a quick one. What else? What, who else? What else? Um, Laura is also a new. Laura's a newbie. She's down, if I'm correct, just on four four pounds. She's been fasting for three days, and same as Myrna. Myrna. Um, that's a quick squeeze through, but everybody is succeeding. Everybody's winning. Yes. We do come across times when we're carrying extra water. But Tanya in our VIP Snakers group confirmed with everybody. She showed some pics that even though when we're carrying extra water and maybe the scale does not drop, we are still losing fat because the photographs never lie. Proper photographs, no Photoshop, they don't lie. So the photographs are showing nice lean abs coming through. Great fat loss happening all the time. Guys, remember, I only, only do 72s and 96s. Always, because that strengthens one, in us. that strengthens one to live a fasting focused lifestyle. Everything is under control. Everything is through um with confidence everybody knows when you get when you everybody knows when we're going to eat so it's 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 a routine that strengthens one mentally built up confidence in what you're doing and you're able to handle it you know it's like when they just handle it you're able to handle it and enjoy reap the benefits of the health and the the results and you just know that boom Three days later, I'm going to have a meal. Okay, tonight I am going to be discussing um, your refeeds. Now, I'm very big on making sure that the refeeds gradually change. So we start off with always, I, the way I coach, 
I want to just say something. I am a snake diet. I am an official snake diet coach. The founder of Snake Diet is our awesome Cole Robinson that I support. I have my coaching manner and so do all the other co uh, the official snake diet coaches have their manner. Now, we all have different personalities and different fasting routines, etc. Okay? But we all follow the snake diet principles. So, the way I do my refeeds, it's all according to my manner and feeding the body in a, in, 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 through health, etc. It's all the food groups as well, okay? I enjoy rolling and coaching with 72s and 96s. I don't coach longer than that. My experience is only with 72s and 96s because um, not, I've, done, uh, I've coached people that go longer, no problem, and, they, and you are welcome to fast longer than 96 hours. I have coached them, but I don't personally encourage that. You guys can do that. If you want to go longer, go for it. Go for it. I, I will support you with it. Um, if you have that, if you just want to go for it. But I believe with the, 90, with the 72s and the 96s, it creates a, a, sort of, a form of strength within yourself with your refeeds. Because people create yo-yo fasting and they cannot control themselves after they've done for long fasting days and then they don't know how to maintain. You will lose a lot of weight, sure, fasting forever and forever and forever. And it all depends on what your situation is, okay? But majority of the people are not able to maintain themselves with their refeeds or understand it. It needs to be balanced and nurtured. Now, in my manner of coaching, I encourage 72s and 96s. I know Cole also encourages that. Um, I always start, always start my, my people off on 72s. All right? Once you've got 72s in the, in the bag, let's kick it to 96. And that's it. That is it. With that, you build such confidence within yourself and such strength. Okay? And it's manageable. It really is. It really is. Um, with the refeeds, I like to incorporate light foods in the beginning and then nurture in some other foods as well. Okay? So, we have been starting off in the beginning stages of our refeeds with our fish, a white fish, not salmon. It was white fish, uh, veg, um, cucumber, zucchinis, squash, baby marrows, some blueberries, coconut water, um, and a tablespoon of butter. So, we've got our proteins, we've got our fats, and we've got our carbs. Perfect. And then the following refeeds, I encourage the ladies that you can carry on with the same or incorporate other type protein forms, be it um, steak or chicken or other type fish. But if you're going to have salmon, for, for example, I don't encourage you to put more fat on because salmon's already full of our most delicious and perfect fats okay and it's good proteins and fats you're not going to add more fat into the onto the fish now i mean that's fat onto fat you don't do that so you keep the fish the, the fat away if you're using salmon and you still do the cucumbers and the water based watery type vegetables and you can have your bl blueberries and your coconut water then i encourage you guys to have your steak steak okay so if you grab your steak make sure it's a nice uh, if you grab your, your protein make sure it's nice high protein okay ladies don't be shy of your protein you got to get that protein in high protein um you can still have a tablespoon of butter um 
for those that are um, make sure it's a lean piece of protein and then you have your cucumber and your fruits your your blueberries and I still encourage some coconut water yes I encourage coconut water definitely after you've been dry fasting um, to replenish okay it's got great potassium in the coconut water now I am bringing in with the reef feeds you guys can bring in your strawberries strawberries and blueberries and protein all right I personally myself the way I eat I do high protein I do medium fats and then I carb cycle on weekends so I'm on a one meal a day okay so you guys that are doing the 72s and 96s uh, hours you guys stick to your your pro high proteins and the minimal fats and your carbs which will be the fruit which is like a, a guys just like a handful okay um that would be 40 to 50 grams of mixed berries and then um your other carbs would be from your cucumber and your veggies just a cup and a cup but make sure you do not skimp on the protein now remember i got one question say saying they can't eat all the food what should they eat first protein your protein okay so with myself i get my carbs from my fruits and my veggies during the week and on the weekends it's very seldom though but i would bring in a, a, a carb a hydrate which would be maybe some potato but i don't have it i don't really only if i'm really like on a mission with my training on a mission okay but otherwise my proteins are high i like to bring i like to eat steak and fish and chicken for my proteins and if i don't then i do the eggs all right so you guys for your refeeds now i'm encouraging you to try your different proteins get your steak in or even do eggs you can have like um omelet like a 10 egg white omelet with um two whole eggs how's that now that's awesome now that's awesome okay and your pink himalayan salt and your cayenne pepper and then a lot of people like i've got some questions on the on the snake diet coaching group that Mich coaching with micheline um remember you guys no coffee no tea no sweetness if you're fasting that is that is not snake diet a true snake diet is zero coffee and tea and sweetness and stuff because it stimulates taste buds and you we don't want that to happen during that time you have to clean up the taste buds all right and then also about yo-yo um fasting Whew, you guys i've got a lot of questions about what's yo-yo fasting that's i'll explain it again that is somebody that unfortunately has not yet strengthened a fasting focused lifestyle they have not yet strengthened how to maintain a fasting focused lifestyle that's why i never encourage days on end days on end days on end to fast but if you want to do that you better be sure you know how to bring yourself back ground yourself again in order to maintain a fasting focused lifestyle once you've read all the facts so that's somebody that's out of control it's out of control they're not able to they don't know how to maintain and they try and get take like um shortcuts and and um have coffee and tea and sweeteners and stuff like that um uh, that is not true fasting uh, that is sorry that is not true snake diet fasting 
Cole and the official snake diet coaches will never encourage any type of sweetness um, to help you along during the day. We are purposely taking it out to clean up your whole system and have no artificial nothing in the body. Okay, so careful of that. Make sure you know what you're doing and make sure that you take advice from the correct people and do your homework, do your research. Don't feel, don't feel bad ever, ever to ask a question, even though it might sound silly. You will get flack <laughs> from some people, but don't worry about it. I'd rather ask the question and feel like a dodo afterwards, but at least I got my answer. So never be afraid to ask a question and because this is what happened on the snake diet coaching with Michelin group. Somebody asked a question and some people laughed at it and so what? So what? Doesn't matter. Rather ask the question, get drilled about it and move on. Just that's all about learning and, and taking it with a pinch of salt type of thing. <laughs> snake diet style. All right, so ask the questions, some um, get flat from people thinking that you should know the answers already. Rather, if in doubt, ask rather, okay? Don't worry about anything else. Let's see, are there any questions? Everybody's so confident, you see? Uh. Let's see. Is pork okay like ribs, chicken wings? Um, okay. Ros Rosa Rosara. She asked, is pork okay like ribs, chicken wings? Right. Now, remember, we, if that, if those, if, if those chicken wings and pork ribs and pork and whatever has basting on it no basting has got lots of sugar in it and all other type of spices you can have pork but remember it's loaded in fat so you we want to keep the calories down but that will be your protein and fat group uh, food groups but I'm encouraging lean meats. I encourage lean meats. If you have the pork, that's fine now and then. But we want to keep the calories low. Okay. Guys, you seem to all be very confident and listening to all my advice and achieving all your goals. I'm so chuffed with all the results. So those that have been following us, go check out the accountability pictures of Grace and Marina and Amy and Shana and Paola and Lara and go check out their accountability pictures just type in um, their names and you'll see my name at the top as the coach all right on the other note those who are wanting to join into my snake diet coaching with Micheline Facebook group there are loads of people wanting to join but I just go decline 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 because nobody has answered the three questions if you do not answer the three questions when clicking join to join that Facebook group I will not accept you you need to answer the three questions this is, this is a private group I'm not gonna just allow anybody in that group you got to be a good supporting snaker and you got to tell me where you live and you've got to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you've got to be part of Cole Snake Dive Motivation page. And I'll check it out. So, alright, that's important that you answer these three questions. Some more questions coming through. Ver Hi, Vernal. Ver Vernal says, can we do weight training on snake diet? 1,000% yes. 
I do not encourage any type of training or weight training within the first 72 hours of snake diet in fasting routine. I only encourage you to start your training, especially with weight training, once you start feeling confident enough. So start, if you're a newbie at weight training, make sure you got guidance. But I train with weights and I, I, I fast 24 hours. But if you're fasting for 72 hours, most definitely you can train with weights. But just monitor yourself. Do not do it at the beginning stages. On that note, training, it's important that everybody starts training. Everybody has to start training. You've got to activate those muscles. You have to. Otherwise, you're going to become like a lean, flabby, soft, skinny person. And nothing's attractive or feels great. That does not feel great. And it does not feel great. <laughs> okay? You want to feel strong. Muscle is important. Muscle is awesome. Bruno, what's the question mark? I don't understand the question mark. Okay, skinny fat, that's correct. Skinny fat is when you have low muscle tone. Low muscle, when your fat is higher than your muscle. When your fat uh, ratio is higher than the muscle in your body. And you're skinny, and that's when you're skinny. So not all skinny, skinny people are like in greatest health. When you've got optimal wonderful muscle that's a sign of great health as well the body needs these you just need it you need it to support your body um okay some questions here let's see it says here um bernal says i have joined the gym and lots of Weight training, will it make me lose muscles? All right, now, you're asking, Vernal, you said that you're doing weight training and you're asking me if it's going to make you lose muscles. It cannot make you lose muscle if you're building the muscle with the weight and refeeding after 72 hours. So, when you're fasting, everybody listen carefully. When you're fasting, it cranks up your growth hormone and your testosterone. So best you go train. And it'll crank up your testosterone even further. And then when you refeed, make sure you have a good refeed, Vernal. Especially you when you're training. I love muscles. The only way you can build muscle is if you follow a fasting focused lifestyle, train with your weights and make sure you eat a well portioned meal with high protein and your carbs. Says here, yeah. okay, broccoli okay to eat? Yeah, try it out. Try it out. I know uh, Cole doesn't support broccoli. Try it out. I always push for the um, zucchinis, baby marrow, squashy, cucumber. Okay. Any other questions? Right. All those that want to join the VIP Snakers Messenger group, you have to send your accountability pictures and your accountability post to the snake diet motivation page on facebook that's cold snake diet motivation page on facebook and you have to tag my name at the top you have to make sure you've got those three awesome pictures in the accountability post then you have to make sure that you share my youtube channel to help others encourage others on your facebook page okay you're welcome vernal Welcome, Grace. We were just speaking about you earlier. Just bragging about your weight, uh, your weight loss, your fat loss. The, bringing those numbers down. At the end of the day, we want those numbers to come down. All right, you guys. What's important? Sleep is important. 
your stress levels need to be low. Your stress levels need to be low. Sleep is important. Meditation. Careful meditation. <laughs> Who saw that post that I sent about people were saying that it's evil? All that nonsense. <clears throat> All right. Uh, meditation. Make sure you've got a good hobby to take your mind off the whatever else that take your mind off food get yourself busy with a hobby get stuck into your work get stuck into things that you've neglected or procrastinated on get stuck into that okay anything else you guys everybody seems to be doing great so we have to, we are now people want to know where are we now we are now going to be doing our refeed sunday is our third day so we've just been completed the 96 hour and they had a refeed and then they completed a 72 hour which was dry fast snake juice dry fast and then your refeed which is tonight at 6 30 you break your dry fast i encourage dry fasting after every single refeed after each refeed the next day you roll into a dry fast okay and make sure that the refeed tonight is awesome and after the refeed you follow another 72 that's it but i'm going to change it slightly a little bit so you're going to go soft dry fast which will be monday so get your get your journals out so so sunday which is today was your day three which is a soft dry fast and you're going to be refeeding tonight okay tomorrow will be monday day one nice and confident know your routines roll with it day one is a soft dry tuesday is day two snake juice Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is day three, hard dry. Hard dry fast on Wednesday. Then you're going to roll in at 6.30, you're going to break your fast and 7 p.m. you refeed. And your refeed is going to be 250 grams steak and um, a mixture of blueberries and strawberries. And some cucumber now not too much just a cup just like a just a cup just a cup say 50 grams of berries and then a cup of cucumber all right replenish the body let it nourish you and feed you and then you can have a 250 ml coconut water but remember the eating window is 30 minutes no longer and officially after your refeed you already start your dry fast after that okay so you already start fasting after that meal so make sure you drink some of your water you can have some coconut water and it will be plain water do not drink snake juice on your refeed when you're eating your meal because you've already got your salt and stuff on your food and you're already replenishing. Okay. There's got some questions coming through here. Vernal's been active for the questions. It's absolutely fine. He says, when doing dry fast, can we train? No, I do not encourage it. I do it, but I'm experienced in that. Okay. And I'm on a one meal a day. So no no training when dry fasting can we train tomorrow tomorrow um if you if, okay let me explain you guys if you decide to train so you refeed now tonight okay and you want to train tomorrow then you go snake juice that's that's how you do it that's how you can build up the fasting routine if you're going to be training after your refeed which is great absolutely fantastic take 
snake juice with you when you train just to keep on hand just to keep on hand okay that will work perfectly and then you just carry on as per normal then you would take, then you can do day two can be soft dry fast and then day three a dry fast as well or you do listen carefully if you train tomorrow when you're doing a dry fast take your snake juice with you then on day two you can do snake juice but you don't have to gobble it all down just gradually sip it through the day and then your day three hard dry perfect shana valentine's day valentine's day no strawberries you're welcome vernal shana says valentine's day what's about valentine's day did i miss something let's see let's see thursday wednesday is a refeed thursday is valentine's day so <laughs> if you want to do a 96 okay i'm dealing with a lot of ladies here let's have a vote if you want to do a 96 and refeed on valentine's day you can do it all right and then you can have your steak and strawberries on valentine's day give me a yes thumbs up if you want to do that so it would be monday day one tuesday day two wednesday day three thursday day four your 96 hours either or all right so those who want to do the 72 can roll with it those who are going to do the 96 can roll with it and do a refeed um with strawberries on valentine's day me i will do 96 grace <laughs> you guys i'm i didn't i'm i'm not a, like a big fan with valentine's day because i have valentine's day every day at home <laughs> But okay, let's make it a special one for you. Let's make a let's make a Valentine's Day VIP Snakers event. But we're gonna refeed on Valentine's Day. Okay, Thursday. Vernal, are you with us? Are you gonna do seventy twos or ninety six? Shana, yes. Well, thank you for reminding Shana. Vernal says, thanks for explaining. You're welcome. All right, you guys. I'll pop you a message in the VIP Snakers group. And I'll give you a recap of what we're doing. I want you to say, well done thus far. You're almost there. You're almost there. Some of you are almost there. Okay, keep training. Keep training. Keep fasting. Make sure your refeeds are nice and strong. And stay confident with what you're doing. Trust the process. Support each other. Uh, yeah, Rosada says, I don't fall for these silly holidays. I know. I don't either. But it's actually worked in our favor because it pushes us to a 96 hour. Aha! It really does. It's supporting us in both ways. But don't let it, don't let the holidays and the events throw us off but it's actually working in our favor those who want to do the 96 and fast an extra day go for it otherwise you know you will always be safe with the 72s okay you'll always be safe with the 72s so strawberries came in and valentine's day is on thursday perfect all right you guys i think that's it for tonight i want everybody to stay strong Oh, I want to say, I, ha I received a private message today from one of my South African fans that, I, just first of all, I don't, I don't receive much support from the South Africans down in South Africa with a snake diet. Um, but I received an awesome message saying thank you to me for the as they've been following the principles that I've been teaching. And this 
lady is in the fitness industry and I just want to say thank you. You know who you are if you're watching. And her coach as well has lost 36 kilograms since watching me and studying my videos and the principles of snake diet that I've been encouraging. And they just want to say thank you. How amazing, how it has changed their lives and improved everything. And they are in the fitness industry, in the competitions, fit, fitness and bikini. So, um, thank you for that. And I encourage many more of these messages as I do receive lots daily, but very few from my South African um, acquaintances, I would say. All right. Paola says, thank you, Micheline. Thank you, you guys. Have an awesome evening. Much love always and stay strong. I'll chat soon. Thank you, Vernal. Thank you for all the great words. Stay strong, you guys. Love you lots.